Is it possible to feel like you're dying and thriving at the same time? Go get him, girl. I'm about 10 minutes out from our destination. I am on my way to Canada, but as life would like it, I am not taking the fastest route. <laughs> if you've never been here, oh, I'm so stoked to show you. I'm so st oh, this is, you're so lucky if you're watching this and you just grew up on the west side of Washington because yeah, as someone from the Midwest who grew up around cows and cornfields, like this is, You've got rivers, you've got mountains, you've got evergreens, you've got so much green. Like, it's so green here. And you have the ocean. And you have the ocean. Like, what don't... I'm gonna shut up because this is the best part of the drive, so... Can't forget this. So after studying the map of this trail I'm going to do, there's actually two different parking lots that you can start this trail from. And I originally was going to start at the top. And then after studying and looking at the the topography, the, the change in the grade, it actually, I think, makes more sense to start on this lower lot. So even though I'm starting lower, that means my initial start to the hike is going to be a burn. I'm going to be going up, up and up and up and up and up. And that'll be difficult, but when I finish, I'll be going down. And well, down is sometimes a huge challenge too. It's way harder on the knees, but my pack will be lighter because I'll have eaten food and blah, 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 blah. I think I'm making the right choice. I don't, because I don't want to finish this trail it's a loop, right? I don't want to finish this trail on and up. Okay, let's hope I don't... Let's hope I'm not forgetting anything important. Alright, getting into the first real climb of this hike, already out of breath. <laughs> you're dying and thriving at the same time. Go get him, girl. Go get him.
first official backpacking blister. <sighs> Feels like a rite of passage. <laughs> well, considering this is my first ever solo backpacking trip, I gotta say, without jinxing myself, I think it's going pretty well. I got camp all set up, I took a little rest, I didn't fall asleep, but I just, I read my Kindle for a while, just laid down, relaxed, um, it's, a, it's about 5 p.m. now, and the sun is going down, it's getting a bit chilly, I'm a little worried about that, um, I hope I brought enough layers, I think it's supposed to be a low of 34 degrees tonight, which is, what, zero-ish degrees Celsius, that's a little, that's a little cold, um, I brought plenty of food. I'm really happy with how much food I packed. I thought I would be hungrier. For some reason, I just don't have an appetite, which is weird because I've been I've been going, um, but brought plenty of snacks. I need to make dinner, so I will end up having either chana masala or I think I brought curry, Kathmandu curry, and then after that, I need to pack the rest of my food, put it in a bag, and then hang that bag up in a tree so critters bears blah 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 don't uh you know get it put that away from camp i am a little bit concerned though i have a blister on my right heel that formed it's kind of gross <laughs> um small price to pay for such a, a wonderful experience but i'm a little worried i think i have maybe five-ish miles left um before I complete this loop. There's another trail around here that I really, really wanted to do. I just don't know if my feet are gonna cooperate. So, to be determined. Was fast. Interesting. Um, take that out. Okay, my review of the Backpackers Pantry Kathmandu Curry Lentils, Rice, Potatoes, Peas, Carrots, and Curry Spices. Spice level, it's good. Um, could be slightly salty, peppery, salty, salty, pe wow, this review is going great. I would rate this probably a 6.5 out of 10. It's a little mushy and the rice is a little chewy. The lentils are completely mush. Um, the potatoes are intact. The peas and carrots are intact. I think it's probably just user error though. I skimmed on the water uh, because I knocked it over when I finish boiling it. Sometimes I can be so stupid and klutzy. Like I just, I just tip my water bottle over with the lid off and I lost like a cup of water. It's fine. There's plenty of places to get more water around here. So that's all good, but it just, water is so precious when you're backpacking. I mean, water is precious in general, but no. Uh, well, <laughs> apparently I'm really, <laughs> There goes two more cups of water. <laughs> That's my fault for trying to set up a nice camera shot and then tipping my camera tripod over on my boiling water. So I'm sure it's probably not, not this, this is this guy's fault. It's mine. I'm just trying to save my water because I now have less than a liter left <laughs> because I wasted three cups of water due to klutziness so I'm gonna eat my dinner now and then I need to go hang my uh, bag of food in a tree so okay I changed my mind on the salt level uh again user error I just uh didn't stir it well enough because I just got a big pocket of salt at the bottom of the pouch so, stir it better than I did. <laughs> um, I've got my bear spray ready. I'm all bundled up. I'm gonna put some mittens on. 
snuggle into my sleeping bag and uh, call it a night. I feel ridiculous. I don't know. <sighs> Why do I cry like this? a big baby <laughs> mm. <laughs> maybe I should title this video crying in the back country <laughs> girl dies from overwhelming happiness <laughs> oh I I don't really know what to do with myself I'm slightly slightly bummed I stayed warm last night but my blister that I got yesterday just kind of was bugging me and this morning when I went to go grab my bag of food that I hung up in a tree, um, oh, it was just such a stinging pain. And so I wanted to do a, another hike, take you along on another really cool hike around here that I've never done before. Um, but I think it's going to be a little bit of a challenge just to finish this one. I have maybe four to six miles left um, to finish the loop and I really, really want to do that. So I'm going to pack up after a slow morning, take it really nice and easy and slow, and finish this loop. And I'm probably just going to have to accept the fact that it would not be a smart move to do another. The The other trail that I wanted to, to do uh, is about 10 miles long. So it's three or four miles longer than the one I'm doing right now. So... Next time. Next time. Yeah.
at the Green Arrow, at the Green Arrow. Oh, it must be rush time. Rush hour. Rush hour time? Rush time hour? North. I-5. Left lane only. That is, that is here. That is me. This is my ramp. Turning, 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 turning. You're going. I'm going. No, you're going. You're going fast. Too fast. Sir, it is 25 miles per hour in this zone. Okay. Don't care. That's cool.